Green fodder is essential to feed livestock, but the reduced availability of land and lack of water, it has become difficult to produce required quantity green fodder throughout the year. In such cases, hydroponic fodder may be tried. Hydroponic fodder is produced by growing seeds without soil and with very little water. Within 6 to 7 days, the seeds are sprouted. The seedlings will be up to 30 to 35 cm tall and provide a highly nutritious fodder. Compared to traditional fodder, which often needs up to 2 months to grow, we can grow hydroponic fodder in just one week and only 3 to 4 liters of water is necessary to grow 1 kilogram of hydroponic fodder. Hydroponic fodder can be produced on a regular basis throughout the year, even during drought season. KBK Namakal trained farmers are using the hydroponic device and producing good quality green fodder. The machine should be located in a shady place. Fill the drum with water, switch on the exhaust fan and timer. Periodically fill the drum with water. Now load the trays with germinated seeds into the machine. Good quality well dried yellow maize seeds should be selected. The broken seeds and other dust has to be removed first. Check the required quantity of seeds approximately 1 kg per tray may be taken. Soak the seeds in water for 20 hours for germination. Load the germinated seeds into the hydroponic trays and place the loaded trays into the lowest row of hydroponic machine. Sprinkle water every hour for about 1 minute automatically with the help of timer. Shift trays immediate to the upper row after 24 hours. Load the next set of trays with seeds into the lowest row and continue sprinkling of water. Harvest the hydroponic fodder for feeding livestock from the topmost row that is 8th row. Add one set of tray every day in the lower most rows. Other tray should be changed one row upwards. By this, the fodder can be produced and fed to the milch cattle up to 15 kg per day. Good quality seeds, control humid and moisture environment must be maintained all the time. Failure to do so can cause mold, fungi and bacteria to develop and spoil the fodder quality.